Hello. Well, as you can see, I uh, got a haircut and I shaved. Um, <clears throat> in the next coming uh, little uh, video where I'm talking about film, film talk and all that good stuff, I will have my long hair and facial hair, so I guess, you know, in a way that was made in the past to come out in the future. Um, and I'm going to talk about some other stuff, uh, of course, in the future. And um, I am planning on June, um, um, as I said earlier in the year, to talk about the, my uh, the Quentin Tarantino films, all the films he directed. Um, except for the... Uh, 30 some minutes, I think 36, last I recalled, of um, that, that, that film. Um, he did uh, My Best Friend's Birthday, which had all the, have all the, if all the footage uh, was put together in complete form, you know, that would be then technically the first film he made. But since, you know, all that exists are, is like over 30 minutes of the film that's basically like a short film and apparently the story goes that that was done as sort of like a put together as part of a editing reel for the person who um, was putting it together um, and apparently Tarantino himself has a film and so he's just not to go into release that film and apparently I'll, um, and having seen it myself and also hearing a little more in depth it looks as if that film was like became true romance um, because some of the characters names at least uh, you, know, um, <clears throat> you know some of those uh, uh, are in that film but then also there's certain things like Kay Billy the radio station that we hear quite a bit in Reservoir Dogs and so many other things um, that wound up in some other films of Tarantino. Um, so that won't be part of it, nor will um, uh, you know, nor will the films he has just only written. Uh, am I going to talk about? I'm only going to talk about the films he himself has written and directed that are uh, over an hour long for sure. Um, I know feature films in terms of like certain places, such as even awards and such, they classify them differently. Sometimes it's like if it's a film is. 40 minutes or under, that's a short film, so 40 minutes plus. You know, if it's over 40 minutes, it's a feature film. Um, if the, if a film, in some cases, is 50 minutes or shorter, then it's a short film. But if it's longer than 50, it's, you know, a, a, a feature-length film. So, of course, you know, even though there's a the technical first film that he would have done uh, and made in the 80s, you know, that doesn't necessarily technically what we have now doesn't qualify as a feature-length film. Um, plus, I generally think of it as a feature-length film is 60 minutes or more. But, you know, all the movies he himself has written and directed, I'm going to talk about, so that's nine films. I know people say Kill Bill is... Um, two but it's actually one it was supposed to be released as like a four hour film though perhaps maybe it would have been like three and a half you know depending on if you know because <laughs> considering how you know uh, they want you know the studios would want to have the film in theaters and have as many show times as possible. They would probably have to at least, you know, have the film maybe be about three and a half hours at most. So that four-hour cut, you know, he wouldn't. Have, who knows if he would have even been able to uh, 
release that, even though you know it's Quentin Tarantino and you think he could do whatever. Sometimes studio interference does happen. It doesn't happen much with him, uh, you know. Thankfully for himself, you know. But you know, you never know. Just when you think all is well, you know, something like runtime can be a factor. But you know, um, so when I talk about Kill Bill. Both volumes will be discussed. It will not be two different videos. And I'm thinking about doing it differently, like from, like, my least favorite Tarantino film to my absolute favorite. And um, that will probably be interesting. I'll probably begin doing that uh, late May, I would say. Um... um this is um, uh, something I'm really interested in, and I can't wait to uh, 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 get into <laughs> these nine films of his and just discuss what about them I really enjoy. Um, because I enjoy all of his films, but, you know, if I... You know, there, w there would be a ranking of them from, I guess, my least favorite to my absolute favorite. Um, so that's something that's going on. Um, um, yeah, one thing <clears throat> I also want to just say, and I don't know when this will uh, actually come out, but I am... Uh, writing, um, I'll probably, uh, release it, uh, as some book, but I think what I'm going to do is just sort of, like, uh, write some, like, short stories, and I already have ideas for a total of three. I don't know if I'll do a fourth one or not, but I do have ideas for three for sure, and I'm almost done with the first story, yeah. um, I'll go through the second one and then the third and go from there. I don't know when this will be released. I don't want to make any kind of projections because sometimes those can be wrong. And sometimes if I want to make that deadline, I will... Uh, sometimes people rush and then the end product is bad. And these stories will be very different. The first one I'm almost done with, it's just people talking about stuff like movies having discussions about various films. Um, I don't know, that just seemed like something that would be interesting to me. May not be of any real interest, honestly, to anybody outside of myself. Um, but I've heard from some people that uh, in terms of like writing, dialogue is something that I'm fairly good at, so I'm kind of working a bit... Um, with my strengths. Of course, that could also obviously show weakness, you know. And I am working towards that because the second story I'm planning to do is like an interrogation between like a, a cop and uh, somebody in custody. Um, but um, somebody who, you know, wants to talk to this cop about whatever and. Uh, he goes to visit the guy and see what happens, uh, you know, and, um, yeah, I don't know, I just, uh, it's just an idea, and I don't know how long, uh, that will be, uh, I know there's certain, uh, certain lengths of as to how certain stories can be considered, like, you know, novellas, a short story, and, this and that and while I think the idea of them all being like short stories at the same time it might not be considered all that short um, perhaps and wouldn't fit necessarily in a certain bracket but you know want a certain dialogue between two people just sort of talking and such so um, I don't know that's just interesting it's just an idea and uh, I'm working 
so to sort of flesh it out a bit here and there as I'm finishing up my, my first story. And then the third will be sort of about like a grocery store, people just talking at a grocery store as they're working. You know, be a very small one, you know, like maybe like a couple registers or so, you know, like in a little small town, and they'll just just talk, you know, be like in the middle of the work week, you know, uh, like a, one of those days where not much uh, traffic comes through uh, one of those stores, you know, it's not like it's like a perhaps weekend or Friday or something, like a day where not a whole lot of people work, so, you know, they're able to come in and get some stuff, um, but yeah, uh, these are just some ideas that I've got for the next two stories. And I just wanted to say that now, just as a heads up, because, you know, who knows. I'll probably, when that's finished sometime, I'll likely uh, be promoting that. You know, of course, I uh, wrote this book, of course, my Western. Um, so, yeah. Two hundred pages. Um, unfortunately, the, the first prints, you know, there were. Unfortunately, the numbers for the pages weren't there, even though it was when I first uh, finished it. And then the, for the formatting and the small print. I was trying to fix that, but, you know, I wasn't able to do so, but, you know, I, I learned, you know, in the first book, basically, you get all the bad out, but, you know, hey, I do what I can to try and, you know, I, I've learned uh, when publishing the first book, you know, of course, it's through Amazon, and I know some people have problems with Amazon, and I understand, you know, don't think I don't but in terms of publishing stuff like books uh, it's pretty good um, through physical and uh, yeah. physical copies and uh, ebooks um, this is like I believe 969 I recall correctly. It's been a while since I was promoting that, so um, I could be wrong. But um, for the next book, it'll probably, I don't know how much more expensive it'll be. I'll probably, I, I wouldn't, I, that of course is just me thinking out loud now, but I might be like a dollar or so more, maybe like a, about eleven dollars or so, um, but considering you know I'm gonna try and do what I can to make each story of good value. I don't want one to be too short, um, but I also don't want them to be too long either. You know, but sometimes when I'm writing and have people talking and interacting, it kind of get longer than I expected. But you know, I I want them to be of an appropriate length and also the price to fit the length that you know in the first book my first book uh, the reason the price is the way it is is because that's the lowest that you can actually have it and I thought that's a, a pretty good price you know for a first book I could have made it like like ten dollars or something but I thought you know it's my first book I'll just release it uh, at the minimum um, and yeah I have you know no problem with that, um, but just to, to let you all know, and especially during the time when it came out in 2020, you know, 20, uh, you know, I just, uh, you know, for the ebook and then 2021, still some people, you know, might not have been able to uh, get, um, <clears throat> you know, might not have been able to buy something like a book for instance like that so and I was kind of thinking of people 
uh, the situation people might be in, and I didn't want to just go and uh, uh, you know talk and uh, have a price that might be a bit much because you know something like a book or a film you know that should be something that if you buy you know it's because it's fun you know and you don't want something to be overpriced um, but I want it to be reasonably priced and I think the price that it's at is pretty good um, I'm happy with it um, but yeah I am in the process of writing some new stories that will be put into, hopefully, in the near future, into a new book. So, there is that. Um, so, it won't be any time in the immediate future, but sometime, uh, I would say sometime this year. I don't know when. I could never really tell. Um, I really began writing this end of February, beginning of March, somewhere around there. Um, might have been March, and I'm almost done with the first story, so, you know, about two months or so of writing, uh, this one story is, is, I think, pretty good. I would like to say that's a good projection as to how, you know, the other stories will write, uh, or go, but I don't know. I mean, I try to write a thousand words every day. I'm not always able to because, you know, sometimes you, know, you have an end goal of the story of where you want it to end, but then sometimes it's like, well, some days it's like I'm only able to write a certain amount of words. And, um, and there is a counter, of course, on these various uh, writing stuff, like, you know, be it, um, be it on Mac, be it on PC, there's all these writing programs and stuff that are free, and you can see how many words you write, but sometimes I'm not able to always bake it to a thousand. Um, I do, at the bare minimum, do my best to make a uh, write one page. I do make sure to do that. And if I'm not able to get to a thousand, I want to make, uh, make it to, you know, a full page, at least then it's like, I got a page done. That's pretty good for, to me. But yeah, I. That's what I'm doing. I'm uh, writing, and uh, yeah, I'm writing a bunch of stuff, and I'm doing what I can to make my home film, of course, as I always am. Um, that's hard, but you know, sometimes you talk to right people who want to be involved and help out some way. Luckily, I've, for my film, I've uh, revised it to where now it's like under, a, like it's a hundred pages, so that's pretty good. Because first, you know, I had somebody who could, might give me, just to see what it's like, and they liked it, but, you know, it's like, you know, it's supposed to be about a certain topic, you know, it's like, you know, might want to... Ease back on certain parts, and I re-looked at it because, but because one thing is like when for me when I'm writing, uh, uh, when I finish something like a script, um, I'm usually onto the next script or the next idea or something I'm writing out, and I from there I'll write a new script. So I'm always trying to, and also around the time I was finished that had a couple other scripts I was writing at the same time so that had an effect on then why I also hadn't looked at it in a while um, but thankfully uh, I re-looked at it and I did I was able to condense it from about uh, almost 150 pages it was like 148 49 148 149 about the length of like two and a half hours to now an hour and 50 or 40 minutes um, uh, could be a little longer than that, of course, uh, in terms of film time, because there could be some stuff that gets cut out, and some things might be, like, extended from what's just on paper, because what's on paper might not always translate to that sort of a 
length in page to actual length in the very end so you know so the upshot is it primarily just takes place in uh, very few locations primarily one but occasionally there will be some stuff outside uh, there's a couple places like I have, have a scene in a bar have a scene at a restaurant and then but that's like just one scene so nothing too you know big you know course that is always a cost to always consider for things like that but you know you know I'm working on to just uh, to sort things out with that also amongst other things that you know you know gotta do day to day you know, everybody has things they have to do every day uh, so you know you do everything you can to balance everything out and make sure you're doing what you need to do so that's something that's just something that I've been doing and I've been working on and planning just wanted to give some sort of update of sorts you know it's been a while since I've done a sort of a video like this I think beginning of the year was the last time so I thought it's a good idea to <clears throat> uh, have a have such a video now and uh, hope uh or you'll be interested in um, the Tarantino film stuff I'm going to talk about, um, as well as other stuff within the next month and the end of this week. Um, but anyway, I uh, hope everybody is doing well. Hope you're all having a great day and a good, good week. And I shall uh, see you all next time. Bye, and uh, make sure to take care. See you later.